Bunny, did you miss me? I was gone for a day. Did you all have a Merry Christmas? Did you get everything you wanted? Did you see Gator Claws? Did he come shimmying down your chimney? Today's video is gonna be my Christmas hurl. So just like the disclaimer that I guess I have to put is that I'm not bragging. I just, I don't understand people that go on YouTube and watch these videos and think everyone's bragging. I feel like everyone who has a YouTube channel does a what I got for Christmas haul. I, I think, I yeah, everyone does it. Everyone does it. So if you don't like hauls or these sorts of things, why are you watching this? It'd be like me watching a football game and then being like, oh my god, it's so boring. Just like all the words coming out of my mouth like Comic Sans. This is all stuff from my family. My aunt gave me this shirt I'm wearing right now. Isn't it great? Isn't it? Isn't it? Ugh. It is just so sassy. I guess I'll show you guys my uh, big present first and I feel like this is the entire reason why I didn't make a vlog yesterday and also just it's perpetuating my laziness but I got an iPad mini. Ah, I really like the iPad minis. I don't know why people are making fun of the iPad minis. They're less expensive than the iPads. They do everything that the iPads do and they're just I don't know this is like so much more convenient to read than like an iPad to me. Oh my god. And if you have an iPad, this may also be available for iPhone. Oh, I just, I literally played this game for five hours straight yesterday. I'm not joking. It's called the Icon Pop Quiz. Do you see this right here? Oh my god. They come up with these little illustrations and you guess like the names of movies, TV shows. They have like all different categories. It is just so much fun. Download it. It's free. And I started reading this like super crazy true life book. Ah. So like I just, I don't know. I just so lazy. The next thing I got was socks because I like black socks and I needed some new socks. So I got this mega pack of mini black socks, yes, and then I got these organic socks. They're actually called Hutopia. Ha ha ha. They feel sexy. Lavender is my favorite color. I don't even know where my parents found these because I've never in my life been able to find a pair of lavender sheets. But they somehow found them. Lavender sheets. They're so soft. They're lavender, you know, the rest is self-explanatory. The next thing I got I really super needed, I got a new camera not too long ago. I didn't yet have a camera bag for it, so my mom and dad got me a camera bag because, you know, my new camera was just out floating in space, and let me tell you, the only camera that belongs in space is the Hubble camera. That is a camera, right? Mm, not too sure about that. Which is sad because I live like right next door to NASA. My camera no longer has to just like float around like flotsam in the sea. So new camera bag. The other piece of uh, camera top thing that I got is a new uh, tripod. My other tripod that I've been using forever was just like literally the $12 Walmart tripod. So I'm very grateful to have this one because it has all kinds of like tilty and different adjustments for different heights and this is gonna be great for when I want to film some more outfit of the days as soon as it's not like 20 degrees outside it's literally 20 degrees I don't like it so the next thing I got is a coat that I have wanted so 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 bad I love Ralph Lauren and denim and supply it's like my favorite brand that I can access like just in the general public without having to go and order it online I got this kind of crazy military looking band coat. I don't know. My dad was teasing me. He said it looks like a band coat. I think it looks kind of like a Napoleon coat. I don't know. Everything looks like Napoleon to me. It even has tails. Look at that. That is just pure swamp magic right there. I absolutely love this coat. Even though it's kind of like weird and dressy, there's definitely a lot of different outfits that I can totally work this with. I think it's a super functional piece for me. The other thing I got was a uh, Ralph Lauren Denim and Supply sweater. And it's kind of like a bolero sweater. The sleeves are short. And this kind of like goes like right where my pants are, like the waist of my pants. It's not like a long kind of like flouncy sweater. It's very fitted and it's got this really cool kind of like brocade clasp at the front. I'm not sure how good this is gonna come through because it's just black on black and black trim so. And then I got two pairs of Christmas pants. 
these I am so excited about. How many times do I say so excited in a video? So excited. I am so excited to have pants. These are these. Wow. <laughs> All right then. These pants are totally like velvety, corduroy, nice feeling pants and I swear these look just like Jim Morrison pants. Blue, weird, he wore them. Now so do I. Did I say those are from Denim and Supply because they're from Denim and Supply? What? Oh, don't like it. And then the other pair of pants that I got is just a really nice awesome pair of skinny jeans. They almost look like an extremely faded blue but they're kind of like actually a gray blackish color. My favorite kind of denim is like the super 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 distressed denim and this has little pieces all over it that's just ready to totally fray and come apart and I like that sort of thing. It's extra sassy. So uh, those were all of my under the tree presents and now I'll just move right on along to stocking presents. We have extra fancy stockings at my house. Look at this. This looks like some Who and Whoville Grinch stuff like right there with a little stingle stangle on the toe. What's a stingle stangle? Just made that up. Very excited, obviously, about this Blu-ray DVD. It's The Doors Live at the Bull in 68, just with all kinds of falling down antics and the singing and the passing out. Oh, so exciting. Next thing I got is a set of the MAC brushes, and I'll just go ahead and type these puppies right on out. They come in a really cute traveling case and it's like this nice creamy leopard kind of thing here and then oh my god is anybody else just so extremely freaked out by these silica gel packs it's like do not eat i'm like oh my god what if i accidentally eat it they come in this really cute leopard traveling case some people call this cheetah i don't think it's cheetah it's leopard i like leopards not cheetahs Anyway, so here are the brushes. It's a set of four and I really love this style of brush and I don't really know the technical name so I'm sorry. Feel free to correct me down below in Comic Sans. They have less bristles on the top. They're like a little bit thinner on the top. I don't know. Like can we just call it a crown brush or something and pretend like that's what it's really called? Crown brush. You get like a big old papa bear brush and then a, a mama brush and then like little a baby brush and they all have bristles that are like that. Like some long bristles at the top and shorter ones at the bottom. Adam, like two-tone sheer magic going on but I really like these because I have like freakish hands and these are actually like a lot easier I think for me to hold I played around with the testers in the store haven't used these yet um, but they just seem like they'd be easier for me to deal with for some reason don't know uh, literally I don't think that it shows up on camera but my fingers it's like if I hold my fingers up to like some other person who's not me like it's like I'm missing an entire segment in my fingers almost like that's how short and freakish anyway this video is not about how strange I am I also got some Godiva dark chocolate almonds I love anything dark chocolate dark chocolate is my favorite kind of chocolate even though I guess there's only like two kinds of chocolate but the more cacao I can get the better it tastes to me next is another pair of socks so excited about these socks and it's so freaking funny actually because I went to two other Urban Outfitters looking for this pair of socks and my mom bought them. They only had like one pair of like these black socks I guess in all of Houston and my mom bought them I guess like a month or so ago unbeknownst to me and uh, they are over the knee socks but they have like kind of loose little sweater material at the top. Can you see this? I don't know. You'll see them in an outfit of the day, but they're very, very soft and super comfortable. Next thing I got is some dye ties. Just really backwards they did that. They are these thick kind of hair bands and I only have one other hair band like this that I've ever had before. That was really redundant but you can almost kind of like wear these as little bracelets because they're so colorful and 
super pretty and I'm just gonna pull my hair up right now because I cannot stand any more of this mane that I have going on. So soft grunge. Uh, anyway, moving right along. The next thing that I got is a little silver snake bracelet. I really like snake jewelry. So it's a little snakey snake. Do you see the snake? On a black, I, you know, it's just like some kind of cording, I think, but totally adjustable, little spikes on the end. It's just a lovely piece of arm candy. Two more little things. One being the MAC Fragrance Blend perfume. I love this fragrance, but I definitely don't want to carry around the full-size bottle with me. I originally bought this to go to the Panda Bear concert, so that's just what I associate this with. It's called Turquatic, but just go to a mat counter. Smell it. It's like, oh, what did I say before? It's like being adrift at sea, but like enjoying that excursion. It literally smells like all of nature convening in some kind of like harmonious blend with like panda bear singing very loudly in the background. Just cornucopia ears. That's what it smells like. The last thing is a lipstick that I have always wanted to try and I have never had it before. I'm sure if you've been on YouTube for like 2.5 seconds, you have seen it or heard it, you know, something like that. This is actually impossible to open. It is Max Ruby Woo and it's just a really, really nice blue, red, very vibrant red lipstick. And it smells like cupcakes! That's probably my favorite thing about MAC lipsticks is that they smell like cupcakes. Please feel free to uh, leave a video response down below. Show me what you got for Christmas. Go on. I don't think you're bragging. And I will be back on track with the daily videos from now on. I've been scampering trying to edit last week's mail haul video that I did film. I'm just, I'm trying to edit it. Taking my sweet dear time. That should be up soon. Another shoe unboxing is coming up soon. December favorites is coming up soon. Excitement everywhere in the world. I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you had a Merry Christmas. If you want, please take a minute to subscribe. I'd love to have you here. Hit that button wherever it lurks these days, diagonally maybe. Um, also feel free to comment down below. Let me know if you got any of the same stuff. That would be super awesome. Like if we just like had the same stuff. I don't know. I like it when people have the same stuff as me. It's like a little club. Also, if you want, you can like me on Facebook, facebook.com slash graveyardgirl. Or you can follow me on Twitter, Tumblr, or Instagram at Graveyard Girl. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye! <coughs> so I thought Vlogmas was like the entire month of December. So maybe I did or did not mess up Vlogmas. But I don't know. I kind of just thought Vlogmas just went on forever. I just made videos every day forever and ever and ever. I'm back today and just look at my hair. Just look at me. I look like the love child between Shirley Temple and the Cowardly Lion. Just this, this, it's not good. I'm sorry. Sassy, sassy, sassy. Sassy sassy, so sassy, sassy sassy. Oh, I'm dizzy now. Mm. Water break. Ugh. Oh my god, do you guys see this ice cube floating in my water? Ugh. I feel like this water bottle could like sink the Titanic. Mmm. Alright then.